This exercise is called Michigan Tracking. The goal of this is to have smooth horizontal eye movements that are required for reading. And it improves tracking, it also improves your peripheral vision and your visual span to spot the letter of interest. This is what the activity looks like. You start by tracking across the line and circling the first A that you see, and then you go across and you circle the first B that you see, and you continue on circling the C, and as you move through the alphabet, you want to get all the way to Z, and then you record the time that it took for you to do this exercise. You want to do each eye separately, so cover one eye, and then the other eye, and then both eyes together. So you start the Michigan tracking exercise by starting a stopwatch, and then you can track the first line of letters, and you want to circle the first A that you see, you go across, and then you circle the first B, and you keep going as you go down the alphabet with the C, D, E, and so on. This exercise is more difficult when you don't underline and you just circle and follow with your eyes as you go across, circling the next letters that you need to circle. As you move across, you will be able to notice that you finish at the end of the line with the Z and you record the time it took you to do this exercise. So this is Michigan tracking level two with the lens flipper. So it works on horizontal eye movements that are needed for reading and it also adds some focus flexibility that you need to focus through the plus and minus lens with the lens flipper. You do each eye separately with this one. So. You're going to start with the first line through one of the lenses and track along, circle the A, the B, then the C. When you get to the second line, you switch to the other lens and you continue on. You're going to feel your eye focusing hard with the minus lens and focusing soft with the plus lens. The goal is to have quick focus flexibility to be able to focus fast and keep it clear the entire time.